will come back plus 1.3 chart of account in this task you will learn first how to remove your account rename and create a new set of account let's begin you may select either to click at gl account maintenance or you may click at account maintenance widget from here i would like to explain a little bit about the importance of the types of in here i would like to explain the types of account available the first one if you look at my screen there is a orange color this is called account type if you look further there is a white color account all those white color account means it's a normal account and the purple color account is special account with indication at the back special code behind it right if you see there is an account with a sub account under it we call this account parents account for start we remove several of the account the first one is goodwill you may scroll down and look for other account which is other than this delete other creditor delete higher purchase creditor delete and higher purchase interest expense done next Rename the following account. Look for an account by the name of Return Inwards. Let's scroll down and look for Return Inwards. Click to highlight and click Edit Account. Change the account name into Sales Return. And click Save. Click OK. Next is Delete Set of stock account stock is a special account where once you delete it we are going to create another set of stock account click stock delete stock at the beginning of the year delete click another stock at the end of the year and delete account once you are ready click at new special account button stock to enter a new stock account first one is with a code of 600 stock opening another account is stock closing And the third account which is the last one which is balance stock account the code is stock balance save when you click save all those three accounts will be automatically assigned into the designated account type the first one is stock in account asset the second and third is under cost of good sold. Next, remove cash at bank. This cash at bank, we will remove it and we will create three types of bank letter. Click to highlight and delete. Click yes. Very good. If you want to create another three set of bank under the same parents account, you need to click at cash at bank because you want to create under this parent account. Click special account button at your left panel, bank cash deposit. 
enter the account name, description, make sure you select the account is bank and it's under current asset. If you choose cash, then this bank won't show bank reconciliation letter. So you need to select bank. Payment method. Enter. Select general type bank. Payment by is check and payment type is check. Add another payment method. Click once. Enter. Select general type bank. Change payment by to payment type. Okay, ready. Everything complete. Should save. Create another set of bank account which is PBB, PJ. Make sure you highlight cash at bank because it's going to be our parents account. Click bank cash and deposit. Click bank cash and deposit special account on your left panel. Make sure it's bank. Parents is cash at bank. Account number. Description. Payment method. Journal type bank. Payment by is check and payment type is check. Click save. And you have two banks under the same payment account. The last bank will be which is bank. Current account is cash at bank. Account name is Account number is payment method, payment by, payment type, and save. Before we save, let me go through a little bit. In this column, because this is check, so when you enable this option if your transaction you select this payment type you are required to enter either it's check number or credit card if you leave it blank it will show you a message to remind you document numbering format we will learn this in chapter 3 now for a moment and for now you just click save to proceed now currently we have one, two and three banks. Let's say accidentally I would like to delete and show you some example. You create the bank outside or accidentally click at current asset but you want to create another bank by the name of CIMB the one that we I just delete. My CMB currently is outside from the parent account. To solve this problem, what you need to do is, you don't have to delete it. What you need to do, just click and drag. Look at my arrow, it's pointing at the parent account. And release your mouse. Click yes, it will drop into the cash at bank. Next new future set account scroll on top there is one fixed asset account type in orange color and there's another fixed asset which is white color normal account but it has become a parent account so we are going to create so we are going to create fixed asset under this parent account click to highlight Select new special account button on your left option. 
automatically it will select the parent's account enter the account name with it enter the description and select the second account which is accumulated depreciation the description okay once you enter the account it will copy the name from the top and it become accumulated depreciation ICT and computer you don't have to retype it again click save to proceed and you have new account under fixed asset parent next scroll down until you see account type by the name of expenses we are going to create two more new normal account under expenses make sure you click at the account type or else it become one of the sub folder it become if you click any of these normal account and you create new normal account it will become this account will become parents and we don't want that we want to remain same level under expenses account type. click new normal account on your left top panel enter the account name Another account, description, once you are ready, click save to proceed. Two account created, sales expenses and marketing expenses. Next, look carefully at expenses, account type, bank charges. The account number is 902. I would like to change this account number into 916. But let's say if I edit this account, it would allow me to change the account number. It's okay. I'll show you how to change the account code for bank charges click at tools change code change account number click the plus sign select by entering the name it will search for the account select bank charges enter the new account Number. Once you're ready, click page. Account number completed successfully. And click OK. Close. Observe your screen. Bank charges 902 still haven't changed the name into 916. What you need to do is just click at refresh. The number become bank charges become 916. That's the end of part 1.3. Start of account. Thank you.